Now, in less than two weeks, it'll be the first race in the 36th America's Cup match between Luna Rosa Prada Pirelli and Emirates Team New Zealand. A 7-1 victory over Ineos Team UK in the Prada Cup secured the Italians' place, and this was their reaction after winning on Sunday. I'm happy because, yeah, we were only three challengers, but they were a super top team, and uh, it wasn't that um, no, easy to, to get here. So. I'm very proud of the team, I'm very proud of Italy. Uh, everything is so perfect that I think we, we are going to try hard to win the America's Cup. We can promise that we, we will do our best, and then whatever comes, comes, but we will do our best. I think we have a chance. So, can the Italian team pull off a huge upset and win the America's Cup? Well, Mark Jardine is a former European champion sailor and managing editor of Sail World. He says the Italians may benefit from light wins when it comes to taking on the mighty New Zealand yacht. In the light winds, the boat seems very fast. It seems slippery, I think is the term that you would use for it. And the British boat looked like in that lighter stuff, it, it looked took more time to get out of the water and get going. And that made a big difference in the manoeuvres. Now, the Kiwi boat, um, Emirates Team New Zealand, they have been out practicing the entire time and using the same race course that the Italians and the British have been racing on and doing some practice runs on there before their races. And so we've, we've had a little bit of intel as to how they're doing. And the signs are looking ominous for the Italian team. Emirates Team New Zealand are fast, very fast indeed. Their boat looks like an absolute rocket ship. And one of the reported speeds that they've been um, clocked at is 62 knots, whereas the fastest we've seen from any of the challenges is 54 knots. So that's a huge differential in speed. But, and it's a big but, the foils on the New Zealand boat are 30% smaller, which theoretically makes the boat harder to get out of the water and onto the foils. Jimmy Spithill is renowned as a match racer and if he takes the fight to the, to the New Zealand boat, he can probably get that boat off the foils and then actually get ahead of them. Once you're ahead, it's quite difficult to get past your opposition. So they're in with a shout, but it's gonna be tricky. Sailing is huge in Italy and um, Patrizio um, Bertelli, the head of Prada, has actually started this campaign back in 1997. But the Italian public are very knowledgeable about sailing. They've been following this campaign for years and many, many Italians sail regularly. And so this is a really big deal for the Italian public. And so getting through to the final, they've made the America's Cup match before, but getting through this time is a huge thing for them. They're extremely proud. And we saw on the water that their emotions, they kept them in check during the, the Prada Cup final. But you saw as soon as they won that, the Italian emotions came out. And so it is huge. And there were huge celebrations for this. And if they go all the way with the America's Cup itself, it will be a national occasion. Yeah, look forward to that getting underway on March the 6th.